Hello everyone, I am Walt. Welcome back to this life hack series on 101 ways to feel happy on a daily basis. Here we are with our eighth principle in this series, and this one is still about feeling happy because that's, that's what these are about, and this one is, let me check again. This one is to reward yourself <laughs> for uh, for good habits. Um, yeah, sorry, I just kind of blanked on that one, but yeah, that's what I have my computer next to me for. Anyway, so reward yourself for good habits. Well, what is this all about? Well, when it comes to our habits, when it comes to our lives, basically, uh, there are things that we do that we know are good habits, and there are things that we do that we know are bad habits. A lot of people focus on their bad habits, and in this process, they give them more power. Because the more you focus on something, the more it expands in the mind. That's just kind of how the psychology of neuroplasticity works. The more you think about things, the stronger those neural pathways become. And the more you try not to think about things, the more you will think about things uh, in a kind of hilarious fashion. So that we can actually turn that to our advantage, but I'll talk about that in a later video. This one is just more about feeling good, feeling happy. And yeah, how do we reward ourselves for our good habits? Well, the thing is, a lot of times we will do good things, but we don't think they're good enough thanks to our, you know, bad friend perfectionism, basically. So we'll do these awesome things that are pretty you know, amazing, and then we'll be like, oh, you know, like, that's no biggie, that's nothing huge, that's nothing helpful, because we're comparing it to this, like, amazing vision. Often we expand the problems in our life, and we think that they consume everything. Oh, if I don't pass this class, my life will be over, kind of attitude, and yet we don't reward ourselves for all the classes we passed, you know, there's like hundreds in the past. And so it makes no sense why that should happen. If you're going to, you know, be super, like, upset about failing one, you should be super happy about passing others. And that's just kind of how it should work, but instead our mind doesn't care when we pass classes, it only cares when we fail, because we're focusing on the bad bad habits, not the good habits. When you focus on your good habits, you can reward yourself. Each class you pass, you know, buy yourself something or go out and do something fun or, you know, like uh, have a chocolate for each one of them or, you know, whatever it is that it's going to be kind of fun. To give yourself some modicum of an award because the more you reward yourself, the uh, better off you're going to be in this process because you're going to feel happier and you're going to feel more rewarded and you're going to focus on the positive. When you focus on the positive, the positive expands and you can have more positive, more happy things in your life overall. Anyway, that's about it for our eighth principle. I'll see you guys next time in our next video in this life hack series. So thank you all for watching. I will see you guys next time. Stay tuned. I'll see you then.